Up next, please welcome my next guest, the family you all love and hate, mostly hate, the Plastic Puff Girls and their mom, Professor Chris Jenner. Welcome back to the show. It's First been- of all, Ellen, I gotta say that I absolutely love you. I love finding Dory. Me and North watch it all of the time. Also, I love that you're a Lebanese. <laughs> I think it's like so brave and awesome. I have total respect for, um, Lebanesians. You're like my favorite Lebanese person. Um, oh, okay. Well, this interview is gonna be a pain in my Lebanese ass. So y'all are here because the new season of Keeping Up with the Plastic Puff Girls is premiering very soon. The show's been going strong for like forever. You're on what, your, like your 15th season? What's that like? Yes, we just finished filming. And you know, Ellen, they want us to flop and go away. But that's not gonna happen. Because we're the Plastic Puff Girls. And we'll never die. <laughs> That's right, you heard it here, folks. When the world ends, there will be nothing left except roaches, taxes, and Kardashians. <laughs> now, your other sisters are in the show as well. Courtney, Kendall, what about your brother Rob? Will he be making a return? Yes, Courtney and Kendall are in the new season. They're not here right now because, well, you know, irrelevant. <laughs> Rob is still fat. We don't talk about him. But, you know, the love of my life, my hubby Kanye might pop in for a bit. Or you might even see Caitlyn. Who knows? You gotta tune in to find out. Terrific. So, Mama Chris, how does it feel to have literally birthed this Kardashian Jenner empire? It all started with a sex tape, and now all your daughters are huge, rich stars who even save the world from monsters, uh, sometimes. Are you proud of them? Yeah, heavy on that sometimes, Ellen. But, um, you know, I'll tell you. Most mothers would be very concerned about how their daughters are perceiving themselves in the limelight and all that. But as long as my girls are keeping my pockets as fat as Chloe's belly, I don't give a good goddamn about what these little whores do, okay? Hell yeah, I'm proud of my girls. Okay, that's right, girls. Make mama and your favorite Andy Allen that money. I love you, mommy. Love you too, my little slut bunny. Kylie, I want to talk about you for a sec. You're out here killing it in the makeup game. Your Kylie cosmetics have made you into a, a billionaire. But what most people seem to focus on about you is your lips. Does that ever bother you at all? It doesn't, because you know what? They're all probably just jelly of me. And at the end of the day, haters are going to hate. But the lips are kind of a distraction. Do you think you'll ever take out your lip fillers? Not a chance, Ellen. I love my lips. I'm like the new Angelina Jolie out of this bit. I'll never, ever, forever, ever take out my lip fillers. Well, all right then. I think we'd all prefer if you did, but moving on. <laughs> now, now, Chloe, you're still pregnant. Are you really pregnant, or are you sure you just didn't have a big lunch, huh? <laughs> okay. Was that supposed to be funny? Well, well, the audience laughed, so I'd say it was. They were probably laughing at that annoying Spongebob voice of yours. <gasps> or that pelican beak ass nose. You just used that thing to snip all up in your guest's business. <gasps> Kim, don't sit too close. She might stab your eye out with that thing. Very hostile today, Chloe. What's gotten into you? Is it the hormones from your food, baby? <laughs> you wanna go, you six-year-old Justin Bieber-looking dude, bitch? You couldn't go anywhere if you wanted to. You'd be out of breath as soon as you stood up off that couch. Pop down, chubby. Wow, you just got slayed by Ellen, Chloe. Kylie, shut the f*** up and put your lips away. There are children here. Mama Chris, I want to jump back over to you. You've coached and altered your daughter's bodies into being the perfect, um, Instagram thoughts. I, I think that's what the kids say, right? Sure did. My girls are perfect, Ellen. I'm sure we all remember this scene from an early Plastic Puff Girl episode. Chris has given her daughter Kim here some words of encouragement during a very intense photo shoot. L let let's take a look. Damn. Kim, Come you're on, doing Barbara. amazing, push the, sweetie. Push this knee out. Hot. That's push, 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 push. Kim, you didn't have much on in that photo shoot. How was that with your mom snapping pics and whatnot? 
It was literally so hard and revealing. The photographer was honestly so demanding, as you could see. But you can get through anything as long as you have your family there to support you because that's what's most important. Well, next I want your professor, Chris Jenner, to grade our students on some of their independent work on the gram. Well, let's start with this picture of Kim. Mom, what do you think? A solid A-. minus. She's giving you the full booty as she should. Good girl, Kimmy. A side boob tease very playful. She makes me very proud. What can I say? Uh-huh. And what about this candid of Kim at a beach? Her butt looks like a huge, soggy diaper. What's going on there? You know, Ellen, I have no recollection of that photo. I'll bet you one million dollars it's f photoshopped. Right, Kim? Right. Definitely f photoshop. Some people are such low-life assholes. My booty is perfect. It does not look like that. <laughs> Okay, next up is Kylie. She is the queen when it comes to selfies. What do you think about this one? A solid A+. Plus. My daughter Kylie has the face of an angel. Uh-huh. And what about these pics? In one picture, she looks older than you, Mom. And in the other, she looks like a rejected Bratz doll. <laughs> What can I say, Ellen? That's not my daughter in those pics. That's Ursula in live action. <laughs> Kylie, any comment? You guys are just haters. Everyone has a bad makeup day. All right, and lastly, Chloe. What did you think of this sexy magazine cover Chloe did, Mom? A C. <laughs> Mom, you f***ing bitch, I get a C? It looked f***ing hot in that picture. Don't don't you curse at your mother, you little troll. Look at that picture. Your hair looks like wet dog fur. Those earrings are ghetto. Your face looks constipated. Your pose is too stiff. You literally look like you are squatting to take a huge <laughs> Chloe Alexandra Kardashian, do better. Well, I wouldn't be too harsh, Mom, because you're up next, and now your daughters get to judge. Let's take a look at this pic of you from the Met Gala a few years ago. You guys need to stop laughing. There's nothing funny here. I think she looks f***ing amazing. I love my mother. Kylie, what do you think? Ugh, pull the lever, crunk. <laughs> and I'm sure Chloe has the strongest opinion. Go ahead, Chloe. She looks like The Walking Dead meets RuPaul's Drag Race. Get that white walker off the f***ing screen before I go into labor from shock. Well, we're gonna take a break, folks, and when we come back, we're gonna play a quick game of Ellen's Burden Questions with our guests. Stay tuned. Are you ready? Then let's begin. Can you keep up? <laughs> Kylie. What no, seriously. Um, do I look fat? Yeah. What is up your ass? Are you kidding me? It's what she deserves. She has this ugly crying face that she makes. <laughs> this year is really about realizing stuff. And everyone around me, we're all just like realizing things. Are you dumb? She's the least exciting to look at. So you know how I feel. Why would you say that? But you know I'm not happy. You know I'm trying. Kim, would you stop taking pictures of yourself? Your sister's going to jail. <laughs> okay, welcome back. We're going to play a game of Ellen's Burning Questions today with our lovely, annoying guests. First question is, name your favorite body part. Well, I think I have pretty nice cheekbones. My booty, of course. I'm bootylicious. <laughs> My lips, duh. My stomach. It makes me happy. Okay then, next question. What is a hidden talent of yours? It's so weird, but I can always tell when Saint needs his diaper changed. It's like I have supersonic smell of vision or something. I don't know. I'm really good at applying my contour just right. It's not easy, you know. 
Okay, I make a mean chicken Alfredo pasta. Just saying. I can down three number five combos from Whataburger in ten minutes with no drink, no lie. Well, folks, we've got a real set of the X-Men here, live and in person. Okay, last question. Who's the best talk show host ever? Oprah. Well, when she was still on TV. Well, I'm old school. I really enjoyed The View. Well, no offense, Ellen, but I love Jimmy Kimmel. He's my fave. None of you. You chibos never feed your guests. Where's the f food? All right, cut the damn camera. You idiot bimbos, get off my set. We're done here. Thanks for watching, everybody. I had so much fun with Finding Dory. And I hope you all did, too. Make sure you subscribe to Hangy J and Pop Girl. And tune in next time to watch us on Keeping Up with the Plastic Podcast. Bye!